guys, how are you doing? I'm your queen of content, Trudy Kitu. Welcome to the best online TV show. And today, guess who I have here? Hey, Nikona Sean Haro. Mama, you're looking so good. Hey. We are trying our best. You're not trying, you're looking good. Thank you. I, I have to you? keep it to the theme. Uh -huh. Black, white, white, and a touch of gold. Yeah. Yes. How are you? I'm fine, thank uh -huh. you. And you? I'm good. Yeah. Are you Kenya? Yeah, me. I've been around uh -huh. for a while. Yeah. Uh -huh. Ujani ona ona? Sija kuona ona jai. For it, yeah. it's my first time to meet you in person. Me kuona tu kumta. I'm so humbled, but ni meku I imagine I've been around uh -huh. for quite some time now. Uh -huh. Yeah. So today we are here. We're launching something, and you know what is it? Tell us a little bit about it and your relationship with Madam Bosa, the Vesha, and the family. You know what, I actually like the Madame Bose family so much because I'm also that type of person who is a carefree person but works so hard to go and achieve what she wants. So when Vesha gave me a call and she was like, can you come? I was actually in Kisumu so I had to rush and quickly come here. And I'm so humbled that they are doing this. At least now we can get authentic jewelries, handmade. Yeah, so it's, a, it's, a, it's amazing. Yeah. How did you, maybe will you want to leave me? Navesha? Yeah. Ah, we've, we've been friends. We've been friends even before I had my baby. Uh -huh. Yeah, so we one day we met somewhere and now we just started being friends and uh -huh. that was it. Sean, how is motherhood? Yeah. Motherhood is great. Um, there are challenges here and there, but everything is good. Oh, uh, she's leaving. Oh, yeah, she, she's leaving. You wanted to talk to her? No, no, no. I thought maybe you wanted to talk to her. Oh, ah, you talked to her. Okay, okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. Motherhood is great. Motherhood is great. It's challenging. Uh -huh. uh, it's a beautiful feeling. Other than that, uh, yeah. Uh -huh. for, for now, it's, it's, it's just one. I'm not thinking of having another one. Uh -huh. And since you gave birth, your body is for sour. You know, you are for you for sour. Yeah, you know, the thing is, I've always been like a small girl, natural. Okay, a little chubby. But okay, come on, man, I follow from back then, you realize I was a little small. So I kind of feel like once the baby fat is wearing off, I'm beginning to, to go back to my old structure. Yeah. How is the parental hood as well and also being a wife, a mother, content creator, how has it been? Uh, it has been so, so hard because really, I'm, mother, I'm being a mother for the first time yeah. and also I'm being a wife for the first time. So it's, at times it's not easy to juggle between the two. Yeah. Uh, the, the, the three in fact, a mother, a wife and also a content creator and also trying to live your usual life. So it has been a little hard but you know, We've, we've been rocking it. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. We can go to No, 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 Sisa, yeah, uh -huh. Sisa. And I'm sure people tend to believe that when you get married to a foreigner, Maisha, na vile na komplike kidogo. Can you give us the experience of marrying? Yeah, actually, in a komplike kidogo, truly. For sababu, our beliefs and theirs are not the same. Um, example, Mimi, when I had my baby, with them, it's the mother of their husband that yeah. comes to the son's house to take care of the new wife for like a whole month. So I was living with my mother-in-law and it, was, it wasn't it was something I was used to. So yeah, at times she will help me even bath at a kukuosha. Yeah, she will, she will even ananyosha. Well, when I said, yeah, with the tummy, at times unajitoa tu uchi mbele yao. And it was, it was not easy, but with time I got used to it. At I would just walk in the bathroom and go like, ta-da! <laughs> and now I've shown you, you married to a Nigerian. Maybe you're planning to have a land here in Kenya with your husband in Kenya. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. When? Ah, yeah, when I'm a I'm a eco. Yeah, I mean. Let's talk about content creation. Me, Nilianza Kukufolo, Ataka Blan, you feed in Tawai India. Siki Jambo, say to Yaka Jambo. I think 2021. That's when I started following you, and I've been following Baka Saizi. You're really doing an amazing job. So can you tell us how has it been as a content creator traveling back to Kenya when to and fro it come my breakups here in Kenya? And I saw something that you posted about breakups in Kenya and um to make one kina wai wai pale na maya then say to the Pluto, though na in a real part. You posted something and I was so interested. Maybe if I get to, I'll, I'll ask you, uh, can you tell us a little bit of what's your take on this history in a breakup, a part and forth? Mimi, the only thing I can say, um, um, it's normal to break up. Before you are a, a content creator, before you are a public figure, you are a human being. And you know, 
at times what people show us online is not what is really going on. So we, we, we cannot pull, point fingers and go like, Akim, a couple goals, nini, nini, nini. If they decide to share with us and tell us, this is why we are breaking up, we are going to appreciate. If they don't, we are going to respect that. And my only prayer is people are able to like navigate more with the uh, issues of uh, the marriages and relationship. But again, if you cannot work things out and it's beyond your control, always feel free to work out. Because at the end of the day, it's your mental health. And at the end of the day, PR, are you guys compatible or not? So I was sad because zina kwa mingi. Zina kwa mingi. But we are happy because people are choosing themselves. Mtu anasema, hey, this is not something I can take anymore. No, no, this is not something that, I don't think this is working. Because back then, somebody would have been like, Akimi, I'm, I'm Shonaro, I can't, I can't come and say, my relationship is not working, it's failing. I might feel like people will judge me for that. But when I see people boldly walking out, it's a good thing because now people are tending to choose themselves all over the views. Yes. So do you feel it's okay for people to post? Well, <laughs> what's your take on posting like <laughs> Okay, I kind of feel like the ultimate decision lies with them. However, we were seeing you and you are you are pressure. Mukia Chana, let us know as well. And tell us and and, and, and tell us who you man <laughs> Don't come here and tell us that you okay. Be very patient with us. Give us time. Abala, just come and tell us. Uyu alikuwa nakula inche. Nikamuacha. So that we know. So that ato wale wako inje, wako kwa soko, wakio na uyu, wana say, eh, uyu ni wako, uyu ni mahanyaji. Like if you come and you're like, guys, just give us some time. And you know, we are asking for time. Which time? Mukikuwa mnatuwa na pressure hapa, tikapu luko, kapu luko. Ha ha ha. So, so now, if you choose to be private, be private. But again, the ultimate, uh, uh, the ultimate choice lies with them. No, the ultimate choice lies with them. Lakini kama meamua, you are public, eh? Sasa let's say kama nani. Me and my husband now, tukia motu kuje, now we are creating content as a couple. Tuachane. Inafa tukuje tushikane, tusele guys. Lastly, talk to young mom, young wife, young content creators who look up to because when you're role model, what you're doing, stand, stand. Let me tell you. You wait. Me when people tell me I'm their role model, I tend to be a little shy. I'm like, oh, okay. Me too. You don't know how to make people happy outside. Even me, if you have one. Let's talk to them. A message to them. Okay. Me, the only thing I can say is. You can be anything you want in life. You can be anything in life. You can turn your brand around. You can turn your life around. Me, I remember, and this is something I say all the time. I know, at a, the person who told me this, when I had my baby, I wanted to go out with some of my friends. And they looked me dead in the eye and they told me, oh my God, Sean, no, we can't go anywhere with you ever. Because what if your baby starts to cry? And they're like, your life is ruined. Right now, I don't. Last month, I was in Singapore for a whole month. I went to Malaysia. I've gone to Jamaica. The thing is, don't let anybody tell you anything in this world. And the others, you come out, I don't know. I don't know. But the thing is, that is something I kept in my heart. And I didn't fight with anybody. I didn't argue. I said, you know what? I'm going to change my story. I'm not going to be the mother who had a child and let the mother who take everything away. And it's not easy. I remember there was a time I really wanted to lose weight so bad. I, I was running Pakan Kabunji Kambu, I was even admitted in the hospital because now I was giving myself too much pressure. I just wanted to get back. No, no. But now I let things run naturally. And here I am. I'm looking good. I'm looking. Yeah, so never give up. Don't let your current situation um, determine who you are. It doesn't matter. Um, Kama sa easy things are not working out. Content creators, it takes time. Don't compare yourself. Unanam to mingina na pata 200k views. Where you are, you are even doing better work, and you are, and you are getting 10k. I'm a five. Don't give up. It's not your time yet. Something I like to say, you guys can pick anything. I can have any, anything I want. Whatever I don't have right now is only because God thinks I'm not ready. And when I am, I'll get it. So kama saizi au pata hizo views zako, usi stress. God thinks you're not ready. And when you are, you're gonna get it. You're gonna be the next Shonaro, even bigger. The next Rudy, even bigger. The last one is, you know, we are doing a lot of doing plastic surgery. 
Yes, at, there was a time I wanted to. Um, I wanted to do um, the upper, the, the breast. But, I don't, I don't know. I, I was like, as soon as my baby is done breastfeeding, it's something I can do. Because I decided I'm gonna do my baby's breastfeeding exclusively for six months. It's been six months down the line. So I don't know, but maybe, maybe, it's, I don't know. It's something, yeah, I, might, I might or I might not. Because Saizi, I've snatched back well. I like the weight. Sababu, I felt like I was too big. I didn't know how to dress my big body. Saizi, I'm back to my small size and I feel like I'm okay. okay. Thank you so much, Sean. Thank you so much for your love. You're so an amazing person. Thank, Thank you. you. Welcome. Bye bye. Okay.